Good afternoon, my name is Michelle Young and I am a local school council uh, member and a member of Action Now. We are here today to call on CPS to stop school turnarounds and closing in the African American low income community. Closing schools and our neighborhood schools with CPS policy under Paul Ballas, Artie Duncan, and now Jean Claude Bazaar. Research has shown over and over again it does not work and it hurts students of color, so why does it keep happening? As we all know, today is Martin Luther King Day. <laughs> Dr. King lived here in the North Blondell 25 <clears throat> years ago and saw the racial and unequal equality in this neighborhood. Unfortunately, this inequality still exists today in Chicago public school education system. I fought with parents and teachers at Bidler to stop it from being taken over by a charter school. Bidler is a neighborhood school that was improving and has fought for a new playground for years. All of a sudden, CPS get a school a new playground and then announces that Bidler's students will be kicked out of that building to make way for a charter school. By the parents, teachers, and community members united together to fight for their school, and we won. But this is not the case at many schools, and we're sick and tired of it. CPS policy of closing and turnarounds has left low-income students of color in the bottom tier of schools, and school has become isolated from their community. We refuse. I repeat, we refuse. Yeah. That's right. That's right. That's right. Continue to harm our children. Our children are our future. And don't fool yourself, CPS, they're your future too. Yeah. 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 My yeah. King yeah. said, yeah. there come a time when silence is betrayal, and we will not be silenced anymore. I stand here today as an Action Now member and stand with parents to remind them the schools aren't failing, the CPS system is failing. Yeah. 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 